everybody, and good Friday evening to you. It is uh, Weather for Weather Geeks. You know, we've got a really nice forecast for much of the next several days, but the exception the next handful of hours, it's pretty gnarly out there this evening with a cold rain and snowflakes falling across the area. And this is going to be the case for the rest of this Friday evening. This is a uh, look outside at about 7.20 p.m. on our camera in Niles. This is 4.22 across from Eastwood Mall. Notice the temperature still above freezing by a couple of degrees. Obviously, the road surface here primarily damp. Now, we do have some steadier snowflakes occurring <clears throat> south of this location uh, in parts of Columbiana County in particular here. I'm going to stop the radar animation and kind of zoom in on our local area. It's snowing pretty decently down towards Hanoverton, Guilford Lake area, Lisbon, heading down towards Wellsville and East Liverpool as well. But even down there, the snow is having a hard time sticking to a lot of paved surfaces. Um, the grassy surfaces certainly getting a, a little bit of a covering. The, the temperature all important this evening. You know, it was a March day today in which we got into the 40s, and the sun angle is roughly equivalent to the first 10 days or so of October at this time of the year. So the ground really heated up earlier on today. And even though we're past sunset and air temperatures are getting pretty close to freezing in a lot of places, the ground temperatures are still pretty darn warm, warm I should say. So not looking for a lot of issues on the roads this evening. Uh, eventually, we're going to drop below freezing tonight, but that'll be pretty much after um, most of the steady snow is about out of here. The uh, high-res futurecast animation will show pretty steady snow for the evening, but once we get past midnight, 1 a.m., the show's pretty much over, and we should be snow-free then, kicking off the weekend on our Saturday. In fact, uh, we'll see some sun on Saturday. We'll see some sun Sunday as well, 34 on Saturday, 47 degrees on Sunday. Before we get to the weekend, yeah, some of us can pick up a slushy covering to maybe up to an inch, especially on the grass. This evening, if you have reason to be out and about this evening, watch for reductions in visibility and be cognizant of the fact that you might run into a couple of slick spots, even though, you know, I don't think this is real impactful on the roads. So the weekend, uh, again, pretty uneventful aside from the chill on Saturday. This warm front lifts through on Sunday. A little band of clouds with it early. I think it turns into a mostly sunny day. On Sunday, and speaking of sunshine, now we'll have lots and lots of sunshine during the first half of next week. And boy, next week looks really, really nice because these are the temperatures, but I think we're going to be sunny Monday. We're going to be mostly sunny Tuesday. Now, I think there will be a little front that slides in during midweek or tries to slide in. If it does manage to come far enough to the south, it's going to drag in some lake-cooled air with it. And so there's a risk that somewhere in northern Ohio during midweek, it may be cooler than this, but right now, odds favor that being restricted to mostly the Lakeshore counties up near I-90. Um, at this point, we're going to keep a pretty mild forecast for our television viewing area through midweek. Actually, the tail end of next week also is looking pretty good at this point. Uh, it looks like a cool down would commence towards about the 15th, but I think that's going to be delayed by a couple of days closer to St. Patrick's Day. And, uh, you know, a lot of people will be out and about for St. Patrick's Day weekend next weekend and i do think that saturday will be a warm day but perhaps turning rainy in the afternoon and the rain might try to stick around into sunday keep that in mind if you'll be uh joining in the festivity somewhere for saint patrick's day <coughs> pardon me next weekend now i do think there will be a cool down right around the 17th 18th 19th this is today's uh, weeks three and four outlook from the climate prediction center showing the warmth trying to build back in as we head towards the end of march and even the start of april now i'm less confident about the start of, of april i am more confident in the idea that the last week maybe five six seven days of march are looking pretty mild so the the cool down that comes around in just after st patrick's day probably only lasts a few days maybe three or <coughs> pardon me three or four days and then after that I would expect some building warmth once again for the final week or so of the month of March. In the meantime, I hope you have a great Friday night, a great weekend, and I will see you back here on Monday for the Valley's most in-depth weather forecast video.